tell us who you are and what your background is. Oh, my name is Brandon Ely. I'm an interactive director for Kelsey Advertising and Design and own an e-commerce retailer, TwoBigFeet.com. Uh, and I've been on Site Point for, been a member for about eight or nine years now. Um, so I've been involved with that website for quite a long time. And I understand you have a book coming out about online marketing that you're co-authoring with Shane Tilly. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, um, the book's The Art and Science of Online Marketing, and it's about uh, online marketing, uh, promoting your, your business through all of the new uh, channels like social media, search engine marketing, uh, and online advertising. So to a new website that's just getting started, what would you recommend the steps they follow to get their traffic going? Well, uh, once you've got a website built, you definitely need to get in search engines and you need to start promoting your website. So through search engine marketing and uh, blogging and social media, you can get the word out about your business and uh, start to generate traffic. Social media, everyone talks about that. It sounds so cool. Twitter is the hot thing at the moment. But setting up a Twitter account won't get you traffic all by itself. How do you really make best use of that medium for building a brand and building an audience? Well, it's really a medium for communication. So uh, it's best to try to just communicate with your customers and tell them what you're doing and tell them what you're up to and just try to build a relationship with them. So you're not really spamming them or advertising to them per se. You're more building a relationship with them and letting them know what you're up to. But by doing that, they're kept in the loop and when they're ready to purchase or they're ready to buy, you know, they're going to come to you and you're in constant communication with them. What about email marketing? This is something that we seem to have most bloggers completely ignore. They're all on Twitter, they're all on all the social networks, but they don't really run email newsletters. Do you think they're missing out on a great opportunity? Definitely, definitely. A lot of companies, you know, have a, a large customer base and it's um, an untapped market for them to email to them. I mean, if you've got 100,000 customers in your, in your database and you're not communicating with them on a regular basis, that's just lost revenue and lost potential. Um, by sending them regular updates on what you're up to, by sending them specials and, and uh, promotions that you're doing, you can really drive a lot of traffic to your website and really drive a lot of sales. What about using email marketing for promoting content and blogs? Um, a lot of blogs are seeing a, a huge benefit in promoting their content through emails. Um, there are RSS feeds, but a lot of people still don't know what they are or how to use them. So allowing people to subscribe to your blog via email is a good way to, to distribute content on another, another way. And tell us when your book is coming out. Um, the book should be out in May, and I believe it's going to be on SitePoint.com, O'Reilly.com, and in bookstores everywhere. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thanks.